Good afternoon to all of our viewers watching on Little Guyana 592 News. We are coming to you live here from Strand in New Amsterdam. That's the Barbies Motor Spirits building over here. That used to be Les Anne's, but it's a Chinese restaurant now. Towards that side, you are um, Kanji. But uh, take a few minutes with me. That's the Ebenezer Lutheran Church over there. And we're going to walk down the Strand Road here. This is the old guy in the stores building. As you can see here, this is a very, very old, old building here. As you can see the condition of this building, parts of it hanging. Um, and this is the gas station over here. Oh, Lezans is still there, that's Lezans. Very sunny afternoon here, humid, hot and humid here. That's St. Anne Street there, and that's the Barbie Motor Spears. But uh, this is the Guyana stores here. Guyana stores, and they still operate. The stores still operate. Um, they they still open. They still sell stuff, as you can see. Um, the old Philips radio sign there. <clears throat> and this building has been here since what? Maybe you guys tell me. How old? When? 70s. In the 70s, I'm being told. My father used to work here. My father used to work here. This is where he started his career. At Guyana stores, very old, dilapidated structure though, but um, you're watching Little Guyana 592 News. dilapidated structure very historic though and I wanted to do a live here on this Strand Road show you guys some of the historic structures here and you can see that the building is in very very bad shape And this is the Ebenezer Lutheran Church. This is the first Christian church in Barbies. Moved on a raft and in the Barbies River back in 1763. One of the oldest congregations here. And this is the first Lutheran church in the country. Alright, so let's take a walk down. Yeah, you.
as you can see here how damaged and fragile this building has become you're watching little guy in a 592 news that's the old guy in the store there live and direct from from new amsterdam you can only see it here on Little Guy in the 592 News on this Sunday afternoon here. And we have a corner shop here. All right, so let me walk down and see if See if some if y'all recognize some of the places, some of the changes. This is the singers used to be here. Well now over here, this is Alien Sons. Um This is one of the branches, another branch of Alien Sons. And singers, this is Singer, Singer Store. Over here, this is Homeline Furnishing. A lot of new buildings going up in the town. And this is the Penguin. The Penguin International Hotel. How many of you remember the Penguin? And they're still open. Look at that. Penguin. Yep, the penguin is still here. So y'all enjoy enough of the penguin, let's move on, okay? We're moving on. It's a quiet Sunday afternoon here in the town of New Amsterdam. The penguin. Very, very big complex here. Very historic building also in the town, you know? <laughs> <clears throat> Supermarket here. <laughs> here we have uh, Scotia Bank over here. You know I coming to you, right? This is Scotia Bank. They've been here for quite a number of years as well. Yes, we're coming to you here from Strand in New Amsterdam. It's a Sunday afternoon, so yeah, it, it is kind of um, how it looks. It's desolate, it's dead, whatever you want to call it, but it's Sunday, remember that. It's Sunday afternoon. And good afternoon to you. This is the Mara Auntie. Yes, she's here with her produce. And this is, uh, these folks come out from way, which village? Mara, you come from? Different thing? 
black bush and so and you're here 24 7. You didn't, you, Okay, okay. She has all the fresh fruits and vegetables there. Yep. And she's here. <coughs> all the mangoes. Mm -hmm. All the fresh produce from the farms of East Barbies here. Star apple. Sidium. Sales is good, Auntie. How sales? <coughs> uh huh. Some guava. <coughs> yep. And that's a shot up right there. Yep, all fresh, organic, all the fresh produce, and of course the foreign apples here too. And look at the size of this star apple here, look at that, very big, huge, yes. Kanji, uh-huh, <coughs> Cumberland, you know me man? Uh -huh. I live in New York now, but I'll visit. All right, then. Take care. <coughs> You're watching Little Guy on a 592 News. We're coming to you here from the Strand in New Amsterdam. What's up? <laughs> All right. Huh? <laughs> All right. Everything good? All right. Showing the people this, this side of the tongue here. Showing it, yeah. Doing live. Ron, Mr. Danzi. Good, good. This is a, uh, huh? Yeah, man. This is a Danzi's building here. And that's his gallery over here as well. A Chinese store over here. M Ali, or F Ali, filling station here. <laughs> and we're approaching the Tong Hall. We're approaching the Tong Hall at the New Amsterdam Tong Hall. This is a halal guy over here. This is one of his locations. Hey, hello to all of our viewers watching on Little Guy on the 592 News. This is in New Amsterdam Town Hall. Very historic building as well. They took the tower down a few years ago, as you can see up there. There was a tower up there. Very, very historic building here, the Town Hall. The, the seat of the mayor of the town of New Amsterdam, her worship, Winifred Haywood. This is her seat here, New Amsterdam Town Hall. Well, this is Pitt Street over here. Pitt Street. It's Sunday, so you don't see a lot of people, but regularly in this area, um, would be teeming with people, teeming with people and shoppers and drivers and cars. This area here is the busiest um, part of the town of New Amsterdam. <coughs> As we continue, this is
Good afternoon. Good afternoon, good afternoon. Lots of vegetables, fruits. All right. We're just showing some viewers this part of the town. Lots of fruits, vegetables, provisions here. Yep. Good afternoon to all of our viewers watching. No, no, no. This is Jay's supermarket over here. Jay Supermarket, one of their locations, and that's Republic Bank over here. <coughs> Republic Bank. This used to be um, NBIC, right? It used to be NBIC or GNC. Be correct me, guys. This is Massey, this used to be Geddes Grant over here. All right. This is Bob, Bob and Bob Supermarket. Yep. We're coming to you live here from the Strand in New Amsterdam. This is where the Kasim's store used to be, the old Kasim's. All right. Most of these buildings are all abandoned now. Good afternoon. Mm -hmm. This is GTM over here. <coughs> GTM GTM Insurance They've been here for a long time as well Alright That's GTM And well, look at what I'm going to show you guys now. What is this building here? Look at this. We're going to spend a few minutes here. And part of the name is still visible here. But this, I'm sure a lot of you are going to be interested to see here. Old Strand Cinema. The Old Strand Cinema. <clears throat> and, uh, and that's the that's another building here. Yes, yeah, this is the Strand Cinema. Very old, dilapidated structure, abandoned, and it's here on the Strand Road here in New Amsterdam. Excuse me. Hmm. All right, so this is where 
we will leave you here. We showed you a lot of places. We started at Guyana stores and we walked down the area here on the Strand Road. This is high end shop over here. It's a very historic part of the town. Um, yeah, and the buildings are mostly wooden and a lot of a lot of wooden buildings old buildings built in the 60s and 70s many of them have been abandoned while some have been refurbished renovated and this whole part of the tongue here the whole tongue is a historic tongue new amsterdam is a and um this is one sign of what once was the, t at the time of the movies the time of cinemas and this building here it's gonna fall along someday the concrete is holding it up here um, but uh, there are new spin-offs of, of old buildings like what you see here this used to be I think the one of the offices of one of the political parties they have repainted it refurbished it and that's what you will see in many of the buildings here like um, GTM they would you know they're corporate they've been alive they've been around so they repainted their building to maintain the surroundings and so on but that did that was that's not the case for all of the buildings here in new amsterdam depending on whether the businesses have survived or whether they have thrived over the years like the cinema industry has been shut down so you see it the abandonment of this building here thanks for tuning in though and thanks for checking in with us here on little guyana 592 news have a great rest of the sunday Coming to you live from the Strand.